okay, guys. Don't worry. I can heal. Because I'm a fucking bird. No, 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 no. I don't want to go down there. What did I say? I don't want to go down there. I wanted to go somewhere else. Um. Take a look at a Mosasaurus, you know, if it lets me fucking click on the thing. You. Hold the phone. I'm actually gonna have that as like hardcore fucking red. That bam. That blue. And fucking red and shit. Eyes are like fucking yellow or some shit. something where it kind of like it can get on water but it has to use its flippers and strength and it uses up stamina so I would use that kind of system for my game <laughs>
pretty cool how uh, they made the game. Pretty neat, I would say. Okay, I don't know why you're fucking trying to fly, dude. You fucking, you normie. You fucking, you, you fucking, you peanut butter sandwich. You fuck. Oh, I think I already did that too. Let's not do that again. My irritator will be able to, you know, spread the its arms out like this to the sides. So, and it has feathers on those arms, and it could cover those, th cover the water, and provide shade on the water. So it could hunt fish, kind of like one of those birds or uh, cranes that use that kind of technique for hunting. So, yeah, my game is gonna be very birdie based, very accurate, or considering I have. <laughs> my resources to hand. Of course that animation needs to be worked on. I think this dinosaur needs to, this guy needs to have like, put its, its legs a little bit more backwards and let the tail just sway kind of like a rock. Because you know, obviously I could tell he's not going with, for accuracy with this dinosaur game. But just make his tail do the work and put his legs by his tail so it's it kinda 
kind of like he sways like a snake through the water. Not really using his leg. Or make his fucking legs shorter like the old fucking Spinosaurus. back up again which I it could help but then again when you're doing it in real life it could fucking mean like you will fucking fall down the hill and have fun getting back up and recovering from all those scratches from those rocks so there needs to be like a system where if you jump when you're climbing a hill you will fall and you get you get damaged so of course I need to talk to uh, Predatorio who I believe like how he died, considering I, f I jumped from that high place and took a lethal fall, which at least you acknowledged that I took, I fell. Alright, let's move to this guy right here. And I feel like when you do roars underwater, it should be more deafened, considering uh, most land animals, like mammals, or like humans, and we hear like all water getting in our ears and all that stuff, and you can't really hear roars. But believe it or not, um, like fish or sharks, you can actually hear roars. Or from what I've heard from like scientists and shit, um, which actually is a pretty cool, cool thought. But the only problem is, what sounds did they make? Like, I need to know what sharks, like what sharks sounded like underwater if you're like a fish or something because that would be fucking cool to make my helicopter on or and edotis and stuff like that roar similar to them but just have different pitches um streaker what the hell's that just blue is that it is that legit fucking it dude uh, let's put that there then. Is that some crackle? That is pretty shitty skin, if you don't, if you ask me. That's better, honestly. Needs to be like a uh, just like that kind of uh, open mouth thing, and I feel like it just needs a snap shut. And if I believe correctly, I've seen some skulls of plesiosaurs, and I think I saw third eye. I'm not too sure, and if you don't know what I'm talking about, like third eyes, reptiles have them. Um, like Tylosaurus has it, um, monster lizards have it, uh, most reptiles have it. Only things that don't have it are crocs, and people like to label them as reptiles. And be a true reptile, you need those characteristics like the third eye, uh, which crocs do not have. Um, but from what I remember from Google searches, you gotta rely on Google. Um, and I did not get the crocs are not reptiles from Google. I didn't get it from there. I got it from the fucking museum I work at. Chill out. Um, I think I saw third eye on one of the skulls. It's a rough swing at it. I need to talk to Robert Balker about that because you know fucking. He has more experience in the field than I do. Um, um, it's like one of those things. So, what is it? Kinda like how this guy's swimming. Like his neck. Thank <laughs> you. 
has million creatures in my game at least. Uh, you could hear roars, of course, it'll be deafened a little bit to make it more immersive, you know, underwater. But I wanted to have like one of those scary kind of themes going for it, like in Subnautica, when something roars, you could hear it. It's spooky. got interrupted. Alright. Mm, what the hell is black? It has everything besides black from what I see. Well, I'm just colorblind. have it like Primal Carnage or this game. I'll probably just have it like the aisle where you fucking jump and latch on a shit. You have to use your own force to jump on shit. That's one of those things. These animations are kind of weird.
Yeah, that seems reasonable. I love Ocelot being a sword this guy. Absolutely adore it. You know, it's fucking. Put it black, put it black. I want it to be named black. Okay, apparently it's not black. Okay. Um. Can I make him. Yeah. Yay! That's something. Oh, what can I do? Fucking blue. Things where you have to hold it down and <coughs> what the hell? <coughs> oh, you actually do damage. <coughs> oh, I like that. <coughs> I wouldn't agree with like killing yourself, but it's a neat way of making it. But I do have to see something. Ooh, I like that. doesn't want that fucking bad. I'm actually in love with this. No, no, no. I want that. Uh, I think I want them to be full of things.
Thank you. 